I'm Justin Chang for the Los Angeles Times, and this week I'm reviewing The Villainous, a new action thriller from the South Korean director Jung Byung Gil. <laughs> the Villainous is an insanely violent, hysterically overplotted movie about a gifted assassin named Suk Hee, played by the Korean actress Kim Ok Bin, whom we first see taking out an entire compound's worth of gun and knife wielding thugs. It's a hell of a sequence, shot in what looks like a single unbroken take, entirely from Suk Hee's perspective. A flashy gimmick that the movie will soon dispense with in favor of a more straightforward, but no less blood spattered visual approach. Suk Hee is captured by the government's secret service agency, and after a little plastic surgery and some deadly vocational training, she is ordered to perform dangerous missions for them for 10 years before she's allowed to go free. She also has a sweet young daughter, not the only way this movie resembles Kill Bill and a tortured family history that we learn about in regular flashbacks. Following the plot of the villainous, or trying to invest in the character emotionally, is a more laborious endeavor than it should be. It's best if you just sit back and enjoy the absurdity of its action sequences, whether it's the sight of Suki having to kill someone in her wedding dress, or a trio of thugs clashing swords in a tunnel on motorcycles. It's not quite Mad Max, but it's mad enough for one evening's entertainment. I'm Justin Chang for the Los Angeles Times.